Today, the Liberals are releasing their pre-election budget. We know it'll be packed with reckless deficit spending that will do long-term damage to our country. But the real story that the Liberals are hoping you won't be paying much attention to is actually happening behind closed doors in a committee room not too far from here. Just over there. In a secret meeting of the Justice Committee, close to the public and reporters, the Liberals are trying to prevent the former Attorney General from returning to testify over the SNC-Lavalin scandal. The Liberals are desperately trying to cover up the details of the corruption, and now they're co-opting our democratic institutions to help them. Last week, to the shock of many pundits and journalists, the Liberals abruptly shut down the Justice Committee just as Conservative members were putting forward a motion to have the former Attorney General come back and finish her testimony. We know know she wants to share the full details of what happened after she was demoted and why she resigned from cabinet, but she can't because a gag order has been imposed on her by Justin Trudeau. The former attorney general has acknowledged that details from her meetings with the prime minister's office were relevant to the ongoing SNC-Lavalin scandal. But instead of opting for full transparency and accountability, the kind the liberals promised, Justin Trudeau used his majority to shut down the Justice Committee and prevent Canadians from being able to hear Jody Wilson-Raybould's entire story. Canadians continue to have legitimate questions about this scandal. And frankly, Justin Trudeau's actions are those of a man with something to hide. There are many unanswered questions. The former Attorney General said officials from the Prime Minister's office threatened her. What were those threats? We know Justin Trudeau fired Wilson Raybould. Why did he do that? We know she resigned from Cabinet. Why did she feel that it was necessary? And why is it so hard to be honest with the Canadian people? The only person who can answer these questions is the former Attorney General herself. That said, it's clear the Liberals don't want to let her testify. The Prime Minister wants to keep her muzzled. They're bringing former Liberal Cabinet Minister Anne McClellan to investigate. Not only is she a member of the Trudeau Foundation, she's also holding a fundraiser for an arm of the Liberal Party of Canada on March 31st. Liberals investigating Liberals? I'm sure that'll definitely get to the bottom of this scandal. It doesn't take a cynic to see what the Liberals are trying to do today. They want to use their pre-election, big deficit budget to distract from their ongoing corruption scandal. They know it will drive newspaper headlines and they're hoping it will finally take their corruption scandal off the minds of Canadians. We can't allow this to happen. We can't allow the Liberals to sweep this under the rug. We are fewer than six months from the start of a pivotal election campaign. Only Canadians, like you, have the power to fight back. It's time for all of us to join together and demand the Liberals let her speak.